Both ACP and Scheduler use J2000 coordinates for their targets. Let's see how to set up the Sky X so it shows the J2000 coordinates of the field of view indicator. In the Sky X preferences, go to the Status window section and set up the Status bar. Add the J2000 Chart Center RAN deck. While we're at it, we'll get rid of the chart field width and add the location description, which is the name of our observatory, then we'll move it so it appears on the left of the status bar. When you're done, this is how it should look. As we've seen in other videos, rolling time back and forth is really useful. The Sky X has a built-in feature for doing this. Let's see how to use it. Show the date and time tab, then click in one of the numbers of the time and roll the mouse. It's as simple as that. Here we're stepping it an hour at a time. If you click on the minutes number, rolling the mouse will step time a minute at a time. Okay, now we're ready to observe with ACP in the Sky X.